point of time, um, uh, there are uh, existing uh, platforms that uh, BBMP has, like the Sahaya app. And I remember a few years ago interacting with the Joint Commissioner of Bangalore North, um, who had actually done ward-wise reporting of dry waste, wet waste, and uh, saying how much of waste we collected in the ward. And uh, the beauty of that, that interaction at that point of time was that that data was freely available from the JC's office and even from everybody down below to the residents. And the residents got into this positive feedback loop of trying to say, why is my ward lagging behind and can we kind of catch up, right? And I remember ward 8, 9, 10 each going crazy over saying that, you know, can we up the ante, right? Uh, at this point of time, before I come back to you, Randeep, I would like to uh, bring in Sophie and uh, talk about the importance of open data, the, 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 how do you use open data to build trust with different stakeholders, with different motivations. I know that in the UK, there is a, I mean, I think there's a global movement to do things in a more open way, but certainly in the UK, there is also quite a lot of resistance towards that, especially from private companies who can see the enormous value that data has these days and aren't very willing to share it. And I think it is, to me, it's the role of government to set those as rules that actually, if we're talking about municipal waste, if we're talking about government money being spent, taxpayer money being spent, that actually we, we say from the start that those systems must be open so that they can be scrutinized and that they can be held accountable. Fairly valid points by you and uh, I'd like to endorse what Ms. Sophie has mentioned here, that unless we let out this data in the open forum, uh, we would A, not know whether that data itself is credible because we, we, we would be putting a bar on, in fact, getting any kind of feedback to correct that. So BBMP going along the way, I think we need to look at a more uh, uh, transparent and open uh, um, data culture that needs to come into the organization itself. Uh, so we are now trying to uh, kind of modify our website, try to create uh, Facebook pages, have some Twitter handles, put out any data that we do not feel uh, has to be confidentially protected. I mean, anything, I mean, that would constitute just maybe about 5-10%, but 90% of the data that's out there uh, belongs to the people and uh, it should be shared. Uh, how are different cities looking at C and D waste? There was a central government rules on 2016, solid waste management, which says that uh, every city which has a population of more than 5 lakh should have, it's mandatory to put up a plant within a period of 3 years. But the execution is, is not happening as per the policy. So first of all, uh, more so definitely from an environment point of view, but at the same time, the related angle to it is the kind of pace at which we are growing in terms of construction. And one of the basic raw material for construction is sand and aggregates. I don't know if a lot of people know, but sand is the most used commodity in the world after air and water. So, so it's even bigger than oil. And illegal mining of sand is actually the third most committed crime in the world. So we have a resource, CND waste, which, through which if it is processed properly, we can create sand which will uh, you know, serve the needs of the acute shortage today. We have hundreds of river festivals that happen, uh, not just at the Kum, but even in the south. Uh, how do we kind of see this repeated and uh, scaled and available in different uh, context. Kum, as I shared earlier, three months to set it up and 50 days to operate it, we hit the ground running. Uh, and at that point of time, whatever documentation was a part of the process was done. But post Kum, we've been putting in a lot of effort to document um, the processes, the, the requirements, the infrastructure that was created and how each, the infrastructure was procured. As far as sanitation is concerned, See, we can, we can recreate the system with the existing body of knowledge. I think the more critical input is going to be the ambition to implement it at the next event.